Um, I made a, a really brief introduction. Uh, oh. um, so we've called it the Untold Histories of Archaeology, Archaeological Activists, this, the Untold Histories of Archaeology. Uh, and um, so um, what I really want to do is pretend that this session emerged out of deep intellectual curiosity. Really, it emerged out of us having some drinks at the tag party last year and going, and then this thing that I don't know about, and then there's this other thing, and it was quite sort of an exciting um, uh, conversation that we had. You know, we should have a session about it. But we're quite familiar with some very traditional ways that archaeology is told. So, histories of methodological development, histories of theoretical development. There's, this is a, a, an old copy of Bruce Trigger's History of Archaeological Thoughts. Uh, which has subsequently changed uh, cover many times. Uh, and these tell us quite some traditional stories. So I teach these courses. So I'm at the University of Manchester. I teach all the courses on field practice. And also we've got a course that's called Discoverers and Discoveries, Sites and Sites, which is supposed to be like a big sexy course that sucks in all the people who don't know about archaeology. And so we tell those big sort of traditional histories, you know, paradigm developments, um, uh, antiquarianism, cultural history, uh, processions and post processions, and uh, you know, the, the material term, and all of those kind of things. So, those are the kind of quite, quite traditional art history that, that we're really good at telling. But th the reality is that there is a, a series of untold histories that, that sit between all of those. And since most of you are people speaking about these, I probably don't need to tell you this, but they sit between the margins in those told histories. Some histories are untold because uh, they are voices that have been marginalised or written out of the, the narrative. Uh, and so I put up uh, a screenshot from Trailblazers because they're a fantastic example of trying to bring women's voices back into stories about the histories about archaeology. Sometimes it's uh, difficult or uncomfortable histories which cuts across the established norm, and I think some of the papers are saying will reflect that. And then some of them are, are just untold histories that just slip through the cracks that don't fit with this kind of neat narratives of, uh, you know, we did this, then we did this, then we did this, then we did this. Um, and this is what our session sort of aims to, to get at. And often those untold histories are uncomfortable because they are moments of activism and moments of change. And so that's what we uh, sort of want to get at. So what talk started out? Hello, um, have a seat. Um, what started out as a hidden uh, 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 conversation about activism, about stuff that, that stories that aren't regularly told in a tag party a year ago has materialised into uh, this session. So um, uh, um, uh, we're going to start by hearing about rescue and then SIFA and then ACT. Uh, and then, uh, then Kevin's account of how our group of archaeologists, supported by the trade union, took our management to one of the largest ever protecting awards made by the UK Industrial Tribunal, which has got to have the award for the best tag uh, paper title. Uh, and then we'll be hearing about um, uh, archaeology in Russia, uh, um, uh, uh, manpower services, and then I'll be talking about some reflective projects. We've got a break halfway through, we've got lots of space for discussion. And lots of space to hear these papers, and as we said before, it's a nice, uh, 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 relaxed group of us, so we can just have some nice, nice conversation. And hopefully, certainly, this is this is this is the kind of session that's born out of that moment of going. I'd really like to know more about this, uh, this stuff. I feel like all the other sessions that I'm involved with at Tag this year are all about activism and things, and this is about understanding the background to activism. In, in a way that I'm, uh, I'm really excited about. So I will stop talking. I will hand over uh, to Jude to talk more about.